Okay, with this activity, we're going to make a uh, one-point perspective sketch of this puzzle cube right here. It's going to wind up looking exactly like this. You can see I've got my single point right here. I've got the cube laid out. I've got it shaded. So let's go ahead and get started. In order to do this, I am going to first establish just a single point right there. And I also like to make a horizon line. Do it very light, a construction line. We're going to start out with just some simple cubes that are three across. And you can do this with a straight edge if you'd like, or if you want to make it a little bit quicker. You can just do it by hand. Now that I have those cubes drawn out, I'm going to connect all their points with my vanishing point. and they're fairly light lines. I'm making this a little bit darker so you can uh, see it in the video. Now that I have those vanished, I'm going to establish a back edge. Then I'm going to establish down. And down is just a vertical line. Now we also have a puzzle piece going straight up. If you check out the example right there, we have this going up. In order to do that, I'm going to go about the halfway point and draw a vertical line. Go over three cubes because that's how wide it is. Then go down until it intersects, just like so. Then from the back, you can see I'm connecting with this back corner right here. Got that. Back corner. I'm going to go up. Just a rough construction line. And I'm going to connect everything with my vanishing point. Just like so. go right across right there. Now I pretty much have my shape laid out. Forgot that bottom piece. Now that I have this established, I can go over all of my outlines and pen and you'll see it emerge a little bit better. And again, if you'd like, you can do this with a straight edge. For time in this video, I'm just going over it by hand. With a straight edge, you'll get a little bit better results. I'm being a little bit sloppy for time's sake. <sighs> okay, and you can see all of our lines vanish back into our vanishing point. Now you're going to go ahead and just shade it, just like our example. Um, get this into your engineering notebook and stop this, rewind, and replay as many times as you need to get this.